Hi! I don't know if you have seen the vlogs on my dance channel, uh, but um, we have been in scout camp, which is held in Finland like every six years, and there's like 17,000 people. I don't know, did I think or whatever? And it was pretty amazing. We were there playing for a couple of days, and now we got just home a few hours ago. And tonight we are gonna go to Hungary! Yeah! I'm pretty excited. Uh, my mom actually has like a selfie stick, but I don't know, I cannot find it anywhere. I wish I could <laughs> have it on my journey, but yep, this has to do for now. Yeah, uh, I think I've packed most of my stuff. I got some very nice clothes. And souvenirs for the family I'll be staying in. And um, we're gonna have also a performance there at Hungary, at Serrota. I don't know how to spell it. It's like this Lutheran a festival for teenagers, and um, we're gonna perform there. And it's gonna be epic because we're gonna perform songs in Finnish, and I hope that we're gonna get some Hungarian people to actually sing the same songs in Hungar Hungarian. So it's gonna be awesome. I hope you'll enjoy this journey with me. Yeah, we have now left uh, from Senyuki and we are heading now to the Helsinki airport and um, yep, it's 1 a.m. The city is technically dead. Yeah, our flight is still up there. This is Helsinki Airport. Yeah. We have made it to Vienna. And I can tell you it looks amazing here. Uh, I'm not really sure where we're going right now, but it looks cool and I'm excited. Apparently this was the Emperor's Palace, like it used to be. I think it's really cool that they have like this horse rides around the town. It looks so cool. Yep. Damn! And this was only the Winter Palace and the uh, Schönbrunn Palace will be the Summer Palace and we will be going there soon after this. Alright, let's see the normal Vienna street. We were having, like looking for a place to eat and for my shame we ended up in McDonald's but for the defense it has been one of the best McDonald's we've ever been because none of the Finnish places are like that. Plus it had free Wi-Fi so I could update my Snapchat. But yeah, you know, it's amazing. Still, I really like it here. I just made my sister promise me that we come here someday together and go around this town with lots of time. Schönbrunn Palace. Now this is the other apartment of the Emperor, or like used to be, and I can tell you it's mad hot in here. We decided to have some ice cream and water first before we take all the that Schönbrunn Palace's mountain. I don't know how to call it. But anyways, now we have some water and we're ready to go. <laughs> we gave up. We only got to halfway of the. Uh, the hill. Mountain. <laughs> mountain, Let's yeah. Let's call it mountain. Let's call it mountain because it, it is like a mountain. But yeah, now we are in some sort of car garden area. Or I don't know, forest. <laughs> some sort of 
and it's really nice here. Much more fun than melting in sun, trying to get up. Steaming there. hot air now. Yeah. yeah. 30 degrees. <laughs> It's like 20 degrees. And because we are we are not suicidal, so we want, we decided <laughs> to stay here in the shadows. <laughs> yeah, but still, this castle has been a great experience. Morning. It's the first morning here in Hungary and just with the fact that I was like shaking cold last night I'm feeling amazing today. So here we are. This village is called Ferdehomo, Fe Fe apparently. I don't know how to say it. <laughs> and we're waiting for a bus to go to Sopron. And yeah, everything here is so much fancier than in Finland. Like I was just talking with, and I got that, like all the colors the houses look amazing and even the bus stop is like so pictorial that I said me why nothing in Finland is cool like this. <laughs> My host family is the best. They offered ice creams for us all. Yes! This is watermelon and this is the best ice cream ever. Morning was a great morning. I woke up, my throat is kind of sore still, but I'm feeling a lot better and I actually slept last night, and so did Rika. And um, we're now at the bus stop. I guess we missed our bus, but there's a new one coming always, so we're gonna take that. My yeah. snapster streak yeah. broke. She almost had like 500 days with her boyfriend, and which is we, we all don't have Wi Fi, so it, it got cut. And, um, yeah. Um, so we're going to the beach today. Well, we're, it's on Austria's side, and um, <coughs> we will actually uh, have to walk there for like an hour and a half after this bus ride. But I think it will be worth it. And yeah, this will be great. So I just hope I won't burn myself anymore. <laughs> this right here is mad. We just came up like the first hill, and this is like. First downhill, uh, we're sweating like mad, and it's it's so hot and tough. And <laughs> like we were just saying, like me and my friend Julia, like we're singers. We're about like we're meant to be sound good, not look good. <laughs> yeah. We we don't do sports, but here's where we are. This is not for vloggers. This kind of route, but we just gotta think of the beach, which is waiting for us. Yay! We reached the beach. After the beginning, it was okay, and um, it's really beautiful in here. And we're actually the shadows because we don't want to burn ourselves anymore. And, but I have to say, I didn't notice when they, like when we came like, over the border, like there was no no signs or anything. We just and apparently we're in Austria now. 
but it's cool in here. I like it. We've been here for a couple of hours now and we just got pizza. It's gonna be a pizza party. How awesome is that? Yay, beach volley! Oh, no, no, no! There's Finnish girls and Finnish Hungarian. I don't know, the Hungarian. Yeah. It's a good combo. I hope some more people will come later. Yay, we got some more people. <laughs> Yay! Go, Em, go! <laughs> and a couple of Hungarian girls. Yay! No! Alright, we arrived to this campsite, or like a campfire site, and there was a bit of a problem with the fire, but we got it on, and there's this um, playground where all the grown ups are playing. <laughs> but I guess we're gonna go to the forest a bit to see how it looks like there. Wow, guys, look at this. You look so beautiful. I'm like, I, I love this kind of small, like, I don't know how to call this, streams, small streams. It looks so cool here. We found a bridge. Yeah. This was the first morning I actually did something on my skin, and it's the day when we are about to leave to celebrate the festival. And I'm gonna miss my family so much, but. This will gonna be this is gonna be great. I'm I'm really excited. We have arrived at Sel Rosa and it's really hot in here even though it has just rained. Uh, we just got some really nice ice cream and found out the stage what we were playing at. Oh uh, yeah. It's very cold in here. Yay! Did you tell me that I just saw the first time? I was in the middle of the night. No. This is the thing I absolutely love about Hungary. The ice cream here is super cheap compared to Finland because you have to pay like three and a half euros for one one ice cream bowl. And here it's like less than euro, you get two. And the ice cream is so much better in here. And I got my ice cream and now I'm heading to the main stage to listen to some band. I don't even know what it is, but a local friend of mine, friend of ours, Lily, she said that it's amazing and we should come and see it. So, of course, we're gonna see it. Yeah, let's see how it is. Well, this is the second last morning here in Hungary, and we we're allowed to sleep like to 10.30, which was like super amazing. But last night I started doing a PowerPoint show for our gig today and I finished it too this morning. And um, after that we uh, went and walked to the shop nearby, which wasn't kind of nearby, but anyways, we walked there, 
bought something and when we were like, oh, we're late, we're late, we have to be, we have to be quick. And then when we arrived here, we were told that there's a huge storm in the Cell Rosa area and that everything has been like put down. There's nothing going on right now. And we're not leaving yet. We have one more hour before we leave. And we're just like, what the fuck? But yeah, I guess that's better in, like if we have to choose from storm and being in the motel with Wi-Fi. That's not that bad at all. I'm here still finishing a couple of things with the music and the PowerPoint and uh, yeah. And then I'm gonna go and have the Wi-Fi and eat. Yay! Hello. Hi. Uh, today we've been super busy. I've also done some Notion Brothers vlog because we had the um, concert today and my voice is still like this but Yulia was amazing and we did quite well Yeah. when you look at the circumstances <laughs> Yeah, and it was fun Yeah, and I think also the Hungarians liked it So yeah, and um, we got ourselves um, hoodies, yay! Yeah! <laughs> And we also tried to uh, get into the escape room they built in here, but it was already closed. Too bad. But yeah, now we're gonna chill here for tonight until 10 p.m. And then tomorrow morning we will go to Budapest, and that's gonna be amazing. Hi. We just got back into bus after spending five hours in Budapest and it was great. I shot a lot and now we are heading <coughs> to the airport and we will go back home. Yay! We get through the check-in and security. I got like they did me all these like tests to me and my bag and I was but I got through, luckily, and all the lost passports have been found, and we're here on the lounge. It's, it's kind of lounge, I guess, waiting for our tra travel, our journey, our 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 plane. Yeah, waiting for our plane. Yeah. And I didn't actually shop anything from that, like duty free, but I see if I find something. I just cut my salary for my summer work. So.